Hi, I uh, want to show you the new version of uh, the Freda ebook reader software and uh, it is much improved um, from the older versions. Now the thing about Freda is specializes in one type of ebook that is EPUB ebooks. Now, this is becoming more and more popular although you may or may not have any uh, at the moment. It can read other types, but uh, I understand that Google now has almost a million ebooks available online and they're converting uh, many of them to EPUB. So it's important to have this program even if you don't use it uh, immediately. Now, when it comes up, uh, you can tap pretty much anywhere on the screen and hold your cursor down. You just press down for about two or three seconds and that will bring up your control screen. And on the control screen we have icons uh, to do pretty much everything with this software. You can see here we have what they call the bookshelf. This is the library. Bookshelf is the last 20 books that you have loaded. Uh, so that's that's what you would tap on if you want to access uh, books you've been reading in the recent past. The library is where you import your books from your memory card or, uh, or from the internal memory. So let's tap on library and I've already got books here uh, imported into this library but just to show you how we would do it you, you can see here that here's a list of books and I can scroll up and down uh, and down here in the corner we have what he calls actions so if we clicked on actions and then we clicked on add books there are a number of ways that you can add books probably the best of which is this first one where it says add folder uh, what you would do is click on add folder and in most cases you're going to be bringing in books from your memory card so uh, I could click on uh, built-in storage, CF card, my documents, or in this case SD card because that's where I have my ebook set. So I would click on that and then I would come down here and click OK. <clears throat> I'm not going to do it because I've already imported these books into the library but once I click OK it will bring the books into the library and they will then be there for you to read. So let's say that we've imported them. Now I can come over here and I can click on Andromeda Strain and you can see down here it's going to give me a little bit of information if it has it, the title of the book, the author and so forth and so on. Uh, so um, what we do next is we, we click on the book and come down to Actions and here it says Open Andromeda Strain. So I'm going to click on Open Andromeda Strain and it'll take her a second or two and the way it does it is <coughs> it loads the book uh, a little at a time uh, so you can see here it says zero percent it, it loads enough for you to start reading and then it will continue loading uh, in the background <coughs> in the background excuse me while you're reading now there are lots of ways to turn the page on this machine we can come down here and simply click on the bottom of the page and it'll scroll down or we can also uh, use our finger and we can have a swipe motion from side to side or as I said we can tap at the bottom we can also use what's called the action key uh, you can't see it because of the uh, darkness uh, right now but uh, we can tap on that and you can see now the page number has appeared at the bottom and that is uh, showing us the page number as we scroll so that's the basic on uh, Freda the EPUB reader and uh, there, there are many many other features uh, for example if we want to go back to the configuration screen again we simply hold our stylus down for a couple of seconds and it loads loads it um, and you can see we have find, we have contents, we can increase or decrease the font size by clicking on font plus to make the font bigger or font minus to make it smaller. Uh, we have a bookmark function where you can bookmark a particular page so you can come back to it. You can rotate the screen, 
you can lock the backlight so the backlight stays on at all times uh, we can close or exit uh, there's also an auto scroll like the other software we have there's an auto scroll feature here that'll turn the pages for you um, so that's a brief introduction and uh, hope that makes it easier for, it to you, for you to use the new version of Freda. And as always, if you have any questions, feel free to email me. Thank you.